Alright, hello, and welcome to the Listy Colon, a pirate ship. It's time to solve more problems with Classic. Just like always, I have my trusty companion. This week, it's the Easter Bunny. Let's go swimming under the sea with my bunny. Oh god, there's a shark on here. Run away, run away. I'm running away from the shark. Well, I'm not going under there again. What is your problem, Mr. Pirate? Give me something that I can craft into a peg leg. Don't you worry, I've got the perfect thing. There we go, a wooden mum. Enjoy your wooden mum, Mr. Pirate. Oh god, he's literally murdered her for his leg. Happy Mother's Day, everyone. We're running out of ammo. Throw something into the cannon. Don't worry, I've got the perfect ammo. A baby. There we go, put the baby in the cannon. Oh god! <laughs> I didn't expect it to actually come out the cannon. Oh my god. I'm so bad. I'm so sorry. Who's this in the kitchen? Why it's Chief Muff, of course. Why is there Muff in the kitchen? Oh no. I think I've had an incident. I tried to make a muffin, but I've made Muff instead. There's just Muff everywhere in the kitchen now. There's Muff everywhere. What even is muff? I only know it's a rude word. I didn't think you'd be able to draw a muff in this game. Okay, let's put a depressed naked baker in the kitchen. Oh god, I can see his baguette. Put your baguette away, young man. The crew is almost complete. Now place someone who can help in the crow's nest. Well, duh, let's just put a crow in the crow's nest. Oh, there we go, it actually worked. And there's my star for completing the task. Give me something that prevents scurvy. No problem, you scurvy dog. How about an edible trump? There you go. Eat him up. Yum, yum, yum. Oh no, that didn't prevent scurvy. I think that's made him more ill. When in doubt, use an orange cheesecake. It always makes me feel better. There we go. Oh, yum. Now he's feeling much better. So when in doubt, use an orange cheesecake. We need some pieces to play a game. Do you want to play a game? There we go, have a stone queen, that'll help with your chess game. Ah, oh, there we go, it's cheered them up. Oh no, the table's been flipped, it's just like a game of Monopoly. And now she's killed him. Jesus Christ, it was only a game of chess. Give me something to swab the duck. Duck cleaner? Ducky cleaner, there we go, have a ducky cleaner. I'm not sure what I've just created, but it apparently solved the problem. The duck is nice and clean. The crew has become cursed. Give each crew member something they used to love. The warrior of the group enjoyed medieval weapons. How about a creamy springy bazooka? No, he doesn't like his creamy springy bazooka. How about a sharp duck? There we go, have your sharp duck. Apparently that solved the problem, so when in doubt, use a sharp duck. The next crew member was the smartest of the bunch. Sadly, the curse has removed his brain. Well, don't worry, have a brainless teacher. There we go, there's quite a few brainless teachers out there these days. The last curse rests upon the captain of the ship. Reunite him with Polly. Dead parrot, there we go, have your Polly. Polly wants a cracker, Polly's dead. Apparently that worked. Oh no, now I feel bad because I've given him a dead parrot. Find the treasure map and bring it to me. Do I have to? That sounds like effort. Can't I just create a map and give it to you? There we go, the cheating method. This is not the map I'm looking for. I would not accept imitations. Oh no, I can't get away with cheating. So the map is buried under the sea. Hello, Mr. Sharky, please leave me alone. I'm only here for the map. There we go, pick up the map. Oh no, oh no. Oh, the Easter Bunny's been killed. I'm being attacked. Oh, swim away, I'm swimming away. Pick up the map first. No, okay, just swim away. Bloody shark. Bazooka! There we go, get out your bazooka and use it against the shark. There we go, I've killed that bloody shark. So I can take my map in peace and take it back to that lovely man. Right, here's your map, it cost me my Easter bunny, I'm not gonna get any Easter eggs. Oh god, where did he go? He just flew off. Well, he was off in a hurry. So I think that's pretty much everything done on the pirate ship, so let's go to a new area. Welcome to Paper Plains. Why is there a horse up there? 
I'm missing my partner for the big race. Now, when you say partner, do you mean spouse? There we go. Have a crusty old wife. Oh, God, that's not a crusty wife. You can have her anyway. What? <laughs> what is going on? What are you riding? I don't know what's going on, but you're winning the race apparently against the woman on the ostrich. Scribblenauts, everyone. That is occasionally what can happen on Scribblenauts. You can have a race against an ostrich on a crusty old wife that turns out to be a fish. Okay, you want to go skydiving, do you? I've got a solution for this problem. A giant tornado. Oh god, that's quite big. Okay, where can I put this? There we go. Oh no! I've gone up in the tornado myself. Wee! Oh, hello, Mr. Horsey. How's it going? Well, oh, no, I've gone back in the tornado again. Hello, Mr. Horsey again. <laughs> I'm having fun in the tornado. So this horse wants to be unique. I'll make you stand out. Don't worry. There we go. Now you look unique, surely. You've got three heads. All your legs are really weird and small. Really? That's not past the challenge. How many horses can you say that look like that? Right, I'll give you a scarf then. Now you're super special. Oh, okay. So you give it a scarf and then it's suddenly unique. It wasn't unique before. There must be other horses like that without scarfs then. Okay. Hello, Miss Cow. How you doing? I'm doing a good job. Give me a tip. Um, don't eat yellow snow. That's my tip for the day. Maybe I can tip it with a moving stick. There we go. Tip it over. Oh no, the stick's running away. Oh god, come back, Mr. Stick. Oh, it can't get up the hill. Hello, Mr. Horsey. I don't know what's going on. Also, why is there a chicken eating... Is that spaghetti bolognese? Okay, here's your tip. Have a bouncy check. To be fair, all my checks bounce. This stuff looks like it's fresh. I really wish it was popped. So basically, you want popcorn. Tiny, milky, meaty, frozen, edible popcorn. Sounds delicious. There you go. Enjoy your popcorn. Maybe it has to be that actual corn. So I guess I have to heat it up. With a selfish volcano. There we go. Oh, pop, pop, pop. When in doubt, use a selfish volcano. All volcanoes are very selfish. Always spurting out everywhere. It's time for Scribblenauts University. Help the student through her education. Let's go. Well, you can't get into college without a rideable, speedy, wailing pig. There you go. Oh god, it's actually crying as well. That didn't help you get into university. Really? Since you're a smart cookie, have a smart cookie. That will help. It's even got its hat on. Okay, okay, that passed. That's good. Right, you're now into university. Oh, they grow up so fast. All of the students' clothes are dirty. Oh, what have you been up to? Have you been rolling around on the grass again? Help clean them. Bloody students these days. Messy buggers. How about a bashful tsunami? That'll get you nice and clean. No, that didn't seem to work. She soaked up the entire tsunami. Bloody hell. How about a wet new horse? There we go, get cleaned by your wet new horse. Oh god, no, that set off the tsunami now. Oh no. Where's she gone? Is she still alive? Is she nice and clean now? Surely she's clean. If that doesn't clean you, I don't know what does. Um, is this tsunami going to go away? Okay, it is. And I'm still alive. Where is she? Have, has she been killed? I think the game's confused. I think I broke the game. Oh no. <laughs> Oh, the wet new horse and the tsunami combination broke the game. Oh, dear. I can't do an air show without something to ride. I'll give you something to ride. And no, not that. A flying moist foggy cactus. There we go. Your new flying machine. Oh, God, don't sit on it like that. That must be very painful. Highway to the danger zone, gonna fly into the danger zone. Look at him go, he's enjoying his new ride. But anyway, as I leave that man on the cactus, the video comes to an end. I hope you enjoyed it and let me know your thoughts in the comments. But for now, take care and leave me alone.